We've been out of Chemex filters for like basically a month and I want Chemex coffee so we're gonna find that today. The problem is I have no idea where any anybody sells them like Amazon it's like 30 bucks for a hundred and I'm not paying that so I gotta do some research to see if there's any spots in town. We're gonna try going to World Market. Hopefully they have them. Hopefully. Today is the 50th, 50th vlog. Ooh, this coffee's so good. Yep, today is the Mark's 50, 50 vlogs. And that was a goal that I had when I originally started this. I said, if I could get to 50, that'd be great. Well, we're here and I'm pumped. I, I met a goal. So with that today, I think the theme is going to be goal setting and should I set goals? in the music industry or should I just let things kind of come naturally? It's a question I get a lot. So I'm gonna answer that right now. The answer is kind of a two, two part thing. Like I for sure always set goals. Like setting goals is a great way to ensure that you're making forward progress and you're not just stagnating. But on the other hand, you can only do so much in an industry that is largely dependent on other people for opportunities because it's it's a very relational based industry. So with that, I think for me personally, like I set personal goals, like I wanna do this, I wanna accomplish this, I wanna learn this by this specific date. That way, like I feel like I'm still making forward progress on the days that I have a lot of time on my hands and I don't have a ton to do. Me being an Enneagram nine, I grow to the three and I found that I stay in the three a lot and it's honestly almost to a fault where if I'm not making forward progress and I feel like I'm not progressing then I start to feel really depressed and really like down because I'm not meeting goals and expectations I set for myself. But when people don't call you or you're just in a lull with your season as a musician, then you if you don't like set goals, if you don't have those things that you've done yourself and the, those missions that you've set for yourself, you can really fall into dangerous ter territory of like feeling like you don't, you're, re you're not making it or you're not actually doing much. Because for my career, it's always, it's been seasons of, I'm just super busy and just work keeps piling and piling and piling and then I go into, a season where there's nothing at all. I'm like free all the time. So I found in those seasons, what I'll do is I'll really dedicate time to learn new material on drums, to learn new things like doing this, like vlogging and stuff like that. Um, even like learning different mix techniques and stuff like that so that I can further grow and expand my marketability. I've even spent seasons learning better ways to teach drum lessons and, and better books to, to go through with my students. That way they have things that they can continually be working on. I guess it's just that way in every career. It's just in my career, this is like what works for me and this helps me stay leveled. Without it, I think I would go crazy and my wife would probably want to kill me. Hopefully that, that made sense. 
Mm. This coffee's so good. I missed Chemex. Chemex is by far my favorite way to make coffee. We've been doing like AeroPress and, and V60, which it's they're good, but I just I love Chemex specifically. But everywhere's been out. And like I said, the the place the, the Amazon had it for like 30 bucks, but I'm not gonna pay $30 for Chemex filters. We pay like $10 for ours. Anyway, if you have any questions, let me know. Also, the reason I do a lot of these things outside is so that I can wear sunglasses because without them, I can't really check the, the viewfinder because this camera has a pop-out screen, so I can't see if I'm in focus. Like right now, I'm looking at the viewfinder, but you can't tell because my eyes are covered. And without it, I kind of look like I'm going cross-eyed because that's me looking at the viewfinder, looking at you. Viewfinder, you. I thought I would just clarify that. I want to wear them inside, but that puts me on a level I don't really want to be at, so my solution was to do a lot of these talking heads outside. <laughs>